the first match being played at the Beogradska Arena at the Euros is the final of the Challenge Trophy, where Moldova meet the Faroe Islands. This is a tournament which is uh, targeted on the development of the, the so-called emerging nations. We want them to take part in an official competition in order to motivate them to support their national teams and I think it is a great development on that level. And it's obvious that the players liked it being here and playing in a big arena. Um, this is new. For the first time we had it in, we started this in 2010 at the Men's Euro in, in Austria. But the winners of the two Challenge uh, Trophy tournaments are qualified for a real final. And a real final means that it's very attractive to be together with the top level teams. The match was a big occasion for both teams as they got the chance to play in the great Beogradska Arena with the same procedures surrounding the match as those at the Euro, along with the live television production. Even though the teams were obviously quite far below the standard of those at the Euro, the match was an entertaining affair with Moldova winning by two goals, 30 to 28, after the Ferries had scared them with a late surge. And after the match, EHF President Tour Lian and IHF Vice President Miguel Roja presented the Moldovan captain with a challenge trophy. Is this a big adventure for you guys? Yes, it's a big adventure for us because it's uh, the champion of Europe, of biggest uh, country we can to win. But uh, this uh, smallest country, the challenge trophy, we can win and we are very happy of this and uh, we were very glad to play here in, in this arena and uh, we are very happy. This is all I can say. I mean, this must be the biggest arena you have played in. Yes, this is more biggest. This is the biggest arena where I played, where I have played. Uh, yeah, it's big. If you see the arena, it's what 20,000 uh, 20, uh, people here, you know, and uh, yeah, it's big. What about seeing uh, the heroes from the big teams here? Oh, I've, I'm very glad to watch these matches about these teams. I'm, I'm looking in the t on t only on TV, but when I look in here, I'm very, I'm just, uh, I don't know how to say <laughs> in English. I can in Russian say. <laughs> yeah, now Sweden is here. There's Spanish stars and it's, it's nice. So, has this been a big adventure for you guys? Yeah, I think so. I think we learned much because now we're going, now we're going to see some matches too. That we can see some good handball and is this the dream to be like these guys and play in the Euros? Yes, it's my dream. I will try it. I will training and I will. I will. I think I will play in, in this championship like these guys. It's we are a small country and but of course it's a dream. But yeah.